Hey, what's going on? This is Chris, uh, sometimes known as Hypocrisy in this neck of the woods. But I'm going to give you guys a vlog today, and I want to talk about a few things. Uh, it's probably been a long time coming, so um hope you guys enjoy it, I guess. Uh, I would love to have talked to you over a gameplay, but uh, we'll get on to <laughs> why I'm not doing that in a second. Excuse me for the... I'm just looking at myself on my webcam, and I look horrific. I've got my son's hat on, it's got some dinosaurs on it, it's pretty fucking cool. Uh, I'm wearing that because I just got out of the bath from my head, it's like a microphone, it's got a little afro going on. And uh, I've had a few beers this evening, I went to football tonight, or soccer for you American guys, and I've had a few drinks afterwards and my eyes look like I've been smoking a fucking spliff, literally like, God I look dreadful. Anyway, uh, I'm here, I'm shooting the shit with you guys, just wanted to talk about uh, you know, what, what, what's been happening, and um, mainly because I haven't brought you guys a video in some time, and I'd like to start by saying I'm incredibly sorry for that. Uh, there's been a number of reasons, but uh, but mainly I just haven't been successful in Call of Duty Ghosts in regards to getting gameplays uh, for a number of reasons. Probably you know like it's uh, I, I don't find it I don't find it a particularly easy game uh, to get gameplays on. Uh, I could really pour down into the detail behind that, but I don't really want to, and I can't be fucked. But I'm on I'm on the Xbox One as well, so I'm playing pretty much so every night. Uh, which does suck. Uh, most of my most of my pals are still on the 360. Uh, even the guys that have uh, ones, you know, are quite often on the 360 because that's where everyone else is, which is understandable. I actually traded my 360 version of Call of Duty Ghosts in so I could get the one version. Uh, I'm not I'm not rich enough to buy two, unfortunately. Sucks to suck, bro. Yeah. Um, so yeah, that that's kind of it's put a real damp dampener on uh, on playing COD uh, because I don't I don't enjoy it when I play on my own. As most of you probably don't. It's not. It's not particularly fun, to be honest. I know some people do excel and get game plays on their own, but I just, I don't know. I've just had really, really negative results with this game. And if you compare it to Black Ops Two, like I came home from work and I look forward to playing that game every single day. I really did. And uh, with Ghosts, I just don't. I don't feel that anymore. I'm not engaged to play Call of Duty anymore, on that level. And for that reason, you know, I'm not posting YouTube content because I'm not prepared to grind hard enough to. Um, to get those gameplays and those videos and what I want to say now in regards to you guys is that please don't see this as me uh, disregarding or taking you guys for granted and, and me kind of stabbing the bat because it's not like that at all and this is kind of why I made this video because I did, I'm quite paranoid about I don't want to be I didn't want to be one of those YouTubers that kind of uh, just post content and takes their subscriber base for granted and I'm so so grateful for every single one of you that's clicked that subscribe button and kind of stuck around here um, but I, I just I don't know. I, I I can't I can't post stuff that I'm not enjoying at the moment, and I'm really I'm really struggling uh, with Ghost. I I love the game. I think the game's brilliant. I really do. But uh, you know, there's, there's reasons why I haven't posted videos, and that's not because I don't. You know, I'm not. I could have done live sessions and stuff, but I just haven't really felt compelled to do that. And that's nothing to do with you guys. And I'm super super happy with the fact. That I'm, I mean, I'm at 730 odd subscribers right now, um, which is amazing. I, you know, I never felt that like I'd get anywhere near this total and I have a lot of people to thank um, for getting me this far because you know some idiot wrote in my comments of the day that I'm only where I am because of networking and being a bum boy um, what, uh, he's a fucking inbred because most channels only grow through networking you fucking dick literally that's what YouTube is like if, if you don't know that you're a fucking retard um, that's my little rant over but yeah you know there are no channels that don't grow without networking and you know mine's mine's none the same so um, I'll thank a few people towards the end of this video and uh, this <laughs> It'll probably sound like a final video, like a goodbye video. That's not what this video is. I'm going to post in the future, but I just want to say to you guys that I'm not committing to posting regular content anymore because of just the situation that I'm in. I don't have the time to uh, to grind and get frustrated over this game anymore because of my kind of family commitments and personal stuff. Like I don't, I just don't want to get stressed over this game anymore, and I can't do that. I'm, and what I'm really enjoying is just kicking back and playing with friends, like even on COD, like. Uh, you know, when I can, being on the Xbox One, like, just, just hanging out and playing some games, and I think, like, with the YouTube grind and heading out of Black Ops 2 into this game, I just lost that, I lost that main reason why I play video games in the first place, and that's literally just to hang out with my pals and have some fun, and that fun aspect just got drawn, like, straight out, it was just pulled away, and it was just about almost like, it was almost like a, like, it felt like I was one of them YouTubers that has to literally play, 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 play until they get that video, then they post it, then they go back and they play and they play. Like, almost like, 
grinding it for a living and uh you know i always said to myself that when it became like that that i wouldn't i wouldn't put myself uh through making content that would seem half-hearted or um you know lackluster for you guys so um but yeah i i am going to post some stuff uh, eventually uh, i want to get some new games basically and i'm going to post a whole variety of content i'm going to try out um some sports games that i'm pretty interested in some of you may be like oh my god like sports games are you fucking serious but I do have other interests outside of Call of Duty, and I've always, um, I've always seen myself as quite a good, confident commentator that I could try my hand at kind of any other genre of YouTube videos. So, um, you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have a little play around in the new year uh, with some stuff, and um, we'll see how that goes. If you guys enjoy that, then please let me know. If you guys want to see that, then let me know. And you know, what I will value is the people that are kind of standing by me, regardless of what I post. And I know people do have their tastes, which is fine. And I, don't, I, I may lose some people, but at the same time, you know, I want this to be fun and enjoyable again. And I just want to enjoy playing video games because, like, Call of Duty at this point is just really sapped that, uh, that element of fun and enjoyment away. Because when I play it now, like, one part of my mind is like, oh, I need to make a, I need to get a gameplay so I can make a video because I really enjoy posting and I want to talk to those guys. And at the same time, it's like, well, I, you know, I need this to be fun. And I need to still, I, you know, I need to kind of have fun with my friends. And finding that kind of balance has just been really hard uh, in a mixture of kind of being solo and and, and playing it kind of, uh, you know, on a on a console where not a lot of people have really got the game yet. Um, so that's been really tough, difficult. But I'd like to just end this commentary, this vlog, sorry, by saying um, a thank you to a few really key people that have got my YouTube channel to where it is today. And I'm saying this now because I'm not sure if I'll get an opportunity uh, in the in the latter uh, time of this of this channel, but. Um, yeah, I guess I'll just thank um, some people right now. So, <laughs> it, this may get a bit mushy. That's probably because I had a drink, so apologies. But um, the first person I want to just say a, a huge thank you to is uh, is Eric. Uh, he's known as Spanksy in the YouTube world. But um, he was the first real guy of a substantial size that showed a real interest in my channel. And, uh, and, and actually actively promoting my content. And... Um, Eric's just a really fantastically down-to-earth guy, and what I love about him is he doesn't change for anyone. He always, he always stays the same, he always posts the same, he gives you honest feedback, uh, he helps you improve when you need to, and he, he still remains this really, really cool down-to-earth guy, and you feel like, when you play with him and you talk to him, you almost feel like immediately like you've known him for, for, for a very long time and you're very good friends, and I'll always value him for that. And we did some live sessions together on his channel, and that was really the turning point for me where I started kind of getting a little bit of attention in this S&D community, so I'll always thank him for that. And at that point, like, we hardly spoke before, so it was really cool for him to just showcase me on his channel. And, you know, we did the same on my channel as well later, uh, in the later uh, time with uh, Black Ops 2. So um, he's just a really super cool guy, and I'll always thank him uh, the most um, for just really kick-starting the kind of growth of my channel. And then there's three other people that I just want to say a huge mention to just for being my, my ultimate friends and uh, super cool guys uh, in the COD community and, and for helping this channel. And firstly being uh, Mr. JSD, uh, he's my other British guy in this big American community that we're kind of involved in. And um, he's just always been there just to chat, just to grind game, to, to shout at, to to piss me off. He's just a, he's just a really fucking cool guy. And, um, you know, sometimes he's made me want to throw my controller across the room because he's so fucking irritating. Probably that Leicester accent, if I'm honest. But... Um, you know, he, he was the one guy that I could always rely on being online just to go and if I wanted to talk to someone about anything, uh, he'd be there. And he's just a really cool guy and he was doing YouTube a lot longer before me and he's helped my channel loads in, in regards to what I should post and how I should do it. So I'll thank him, um, you know, till I stop doing this. Uh, Doyle is uh, has always been a character. Uh, he's one guy that I have a really uh, good sense of humour. Uh, well, we have we have the same kind of sense of humour in that the fact that he can send anything to me, and in the split second have me in stitches, and I mean fucking nearly crying with laughter. Like we have a really good bond in that sense, and um, he's been great. Like he's always really passionate about the game, and he's a superb player. And um, I look back across Black Ops 2 and sometimes he literally would be the one person that could make me feel like shit if I was playing badly. And I know it's only because he cared and uh, he, he, he literally like that's, that's just how his mind kind of works um, but at the same time I knew he was helping me get better at the game and I'll always value him for that because you know part of any uh, skill growth that happened between uh, Black Ops 2 and now is mainly down to him and kind of uh, you know his knowledge of the game. He's, he's, he's a terrific guy. And, um, you know, I owe, him, I owe him a lot of thanks because he's he's helped me ultimately get better at the game and made better videos. So um, thanks to him and just for being 
uh, one of the coolest fucking guys I know. Um, and uh, the last guy is uh, Hurricane Esco or Josh. Um, literally a guy who I feel like I've known forever. And when I talk to him, he he literally just sounds like a best mate, like someone I see down the street, uh, you know, every day. Uh, he's just a super cool guy. He can post any kind of YouTube video and it'll still be excellent. Um, it just happens naturally for him, and he's just so cool to listen to uh, and, and to talk to. He's really supportive, and he he knows his shit, you know. Like, and this is the thing: like, he just he he helps he helps you in ways that you wouldn't even understand. Um, so I'm I'm incredibly grateful to even have met him. Uh, I hope one day I can meet him in real life because he's just a really top guy, and um, you know he's helped me a lot. So. Uh, for anyone that I didn't mention, apologies, it's nothing personal, but those guys have been the real kind of uh, backbone of helping me grow this channel and, and have just been my main friends when I've come on here, so um, thanks. I know this has sounded really soppy and gay, but uh, apologies for that. But I, I kind of feel like I have to do it, this is one of the only ways that I can, so um, so thank you uh, to everyone who's, who's helped me grow, in particular those guys. But, um, you know, this isn't the end, like I said, I'm going to make some more videos, and I appreciate this has gone on for, like, what, like, 11 minutes now, I'm sorry, I've just been waffling on and on and on, I hope you guys have listened to the whole video. But, uh, but yeah, I, I'm going to be back with some different content going forward, um, and I just wanted to say sorry for not making any videos, but I'll be back at some point. Um, but I hope you guys stand by me and my and my decisions and what I'm doing. And um, you know, I, the, the people that I want to stick around, people that actually uh, want to interact with me and enjoy me for who I am. And this is who I am. I, you know, I'm not a guy that wants to sit here and and post shitty content of a game that he doesn't fucking enjoy just for the sake of it or for trying to trying to grow a successful channel. Because I'm not about that. You know, if I wanted to do that, I'd probably post Minecraft, some bullshit like that. But uh, <laughs> But yeah, that's not me. But I hope you guys are all okay, and I will see you in a, in a, in a future video. But uh, I love you all. Thank you so much for your support. It means the world. Peace.